Rivers are vital to economic development. They generate electricity, attract tourists and provide valuable resources for local communities. Without rivers, agriculture and fisheries could not thrive. They also have great cultural and spiritual significance. With so many competing uses, however, managing rivers can be a challenge. With the right methods and tools, we can run our rivers sustainably, making productive use of this finite but renewable resource, whilst leaving enough water to keep vital ecosystems healthy. Underpinning this thinking is a new approach to river management, environmental flows. Water levels rise and fall with the seasons. This variation is an important part of how river systems function and each phase of the annual cycle brings its own particular benefits. In wet conditions, water floods down the river, washing silt into the floodplains and replenishing reservoirs and groundwater, vital stores for agriculture and industry in times of water scarcity. As the waters recede, Fertile farmland is revealed and new plants sprout along the waterside. Fish in particular need a variety of water levels to thrive. They may spawn or migrate only at certain points in the cycle. And healthy fisheries provide local people with a valuable source of income. So variation benefits both us and the ecosystems on which we depend. Environmental flows preserve this variation on developed rivers. So how do they work? Scientists partner with water users to understand how the river is used for agriculture, tourism, electricity or to support local culture. It is then possible to calculate just how much we can alter the variation in the river flow and water level without adversely affecting natural systems or economic growth. This information is shared with farmers, industry, hydropower companies and city utilities to make sure we keep the balance just right. Environmental flow models are transforming river basin management, creating a sustainable future for people and nature. Our rivers are the lifeblood of our communities and environment. With better management, we can make sure that they stay that way.